ever wake up in the morning and feel, oh, I need a new body? Well, this video is for you. Hey everyone, welcome back. It's Coach Joe from Stay Fit Anywhere, where I'm helping you get lean, stay lean, no matter where you want to exercise. So today it's all about how to keep your body nice and loose. Because let's face it, our body's gone through years or even decades of wear and tear. And last thing you want to do is wake up every morning feeling, oh my back, oh my shoulder, oh my hips. So today, it's all about a full body mobility routine just for you. If you're liking these videos, make sure you hit that subscribe button, push that bell notification, and you'll know when I upload my next video. So I'm gonna go through some easy ways you can totally just limber up your body in no time. So take the few minutes every morning or every night, whenever you get a chance to, to really just move the body around and make it nice and limber, and really just lubricate the joints. And if you have specific areas of your body that's really been nagging you, hit me in the comments below. Leave me a question, I'll get back to you. Now let's get your body moving more smoothly. This exercise is the side arm circle. Begin with your arms extended straight, going in a clockwise direction, and then a counterclockwise direction. Perform each direction at a minimum 30 seconds. This exercise I call the sumo walk. You want to begin by having your knee go above your hip line and landing at a 45 degree angle. Each time when you're bringing your knee up, you want to imagine you're drawing a half moon. Perform this movement for a minimum of 30 seconds to really begin opening up your hip. This exercise is straight arm shoulder circle. You want to be performing this exercise with your arms fairly straight, starting in a backward position. So at a side profile, you'll see my arms are fairly straight and I'm rotating my arms in a circular motion going backwards. Switch and perform this going forwards. You should begin to feel it all around your shoulder delt. I recommend doing this for 30 seconds in the forward direction and 30 seconds in the backward direction. I call this exercise the core rotation extension. You begin by having your hand on the opposite hip with a slight knee bend and as you're coming across you're sweeping up and around and you're leaning back just slightly so you can get in extra stretch into your transverse. So make sure you do this on both sides. You'll be doing 30 seconds on each side minimum to really get a full movement within your core. In the side profile you can see that I'm coming across the body and leaning just towards the back, really opening up the hips into the transverse, into the chest, and into the shoulders. This exercise is a lateral hip shift. To begin, you want your feet wider than shoulder width apart. You wanna come down into a slight knee bend and start shifting your weight from side to side. And as you're rocking your body, you want the outer foot to feel the pressure and to be pushing from side to side. This exercise is a hip chest opener. You begin with a slight knee bend, your hands are on the top of your hip, you're sliding them down towards your knees. And as you get to your knees, you're arching back, bring your arms straight up into a Y position, and you're exhaling at the very top. So you wanna be holding this position for about two to three second pause when your arms are fully extended. And from the side, you can see the arch in the back and pushing the hips forward and up towards the sky. 
really allowing your body to extend all the way through the movement. This exercise is a torso dip. You want to begin in a split stance, so having one leg in front of the other. Arms are out extended straight, and you want to be rocking side to side or tilting side to side up and down. So this will work not only on your balance, but really help to mobilize your core and your hips. Switch stance and perform 30 seconds minimum on each side. This exercise targets your hip, transverse, and back. You want to begin by standing in a neutral position with your arms straight up. And as you come down into your lunge position, you want to sweep the arm across your knee and hold for about two to three seconds. You want to perform this 30 seconds on each side. And as you're going through, make sure that you're breathing out when you come out of your lunge position. It's a great exercise for a full body mobility warm up. This exercise is the marching torso twist. You want to begin by bringing your knee to hip height, have your arms extended, and as you're rotating, you want your opposite arm crossing the knee that you're raising. There you have it, a nice, quick, efficient, simple routine that you can get the body nice and limber, moving more smoothly in about five minutes. So take the time to do this full body mobility routine. You can do that right in front of the TV, right before bed, or first thing in the morning. I like to do it first thing in the morning because one, it gets that body nice and loose and gets my day going. And remember to download my free guide, how to kickstart your fat loss in the descriptions below. And if you're looking for a specific upper body or lower body mobility exercise, you gotta check out these videos. Mm-hmm.